Hello everyone and welcome to this video. Um, I'm going to be talking and walking you through this uh, Ultra Instinct Goku drawing I did. Now I didn't, uh, I made the mistake of not recording while I was drawing, but I did manage to get like screenshots uh, during the process, so I'm gonna like show those and walk you through my thoughts while drawing. So yeah, uh, here we have an Ultra Instinct Goku. To begin with, I like uh, started mapping out in black, like the pose and stuff, and in red I did details like the muscles and like the composition and stuff, and in blue I did like the hair and whatnot. I had a bit of trouble with the hands at the beginning, but uh, we bored. Um, I continued to do like the rest of the body, the muscles and the stuff on the legs. Uh, the knees were a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, as I continued, I added like veins here and there. Uh, and also, when I wanted to like start with the clothes, I changed the color to green to kind of make it more easier for me to see. And for the clothes, I kind of like wanted to have them all like ripped and stuff. Like, it's not even wearing a shirt because if you know Goku, his clothes usually get ripped in the anime and whatnot. Um, but yeah, moving on to like the lineup, the hair was like clean at the beginning, like I wanted the line art to be like smooth and cleaner, but it got rougher as I was like drawing, and I felt I should change the hair to kind of like suit the rest of the body and stuff in terms of like art style and like line work. And I really prefer this kind of scratchy, sketchy, like rougher line work, and I felt I should like keep that for the rest of the drawing. So yeah, there is the, um, there's just the line art and uh, some hatching. Uh, more rough than clean and from there I just started coloring now I wanted the colors to be uh, kind of like not opaque but like more saturated uh, so not so bright as you can see as I did the flats for the hair and the, the gi and like the wristbands I wanted them to be like kind of like darker and more saturated um, and I felt that would be a good idea because when I introduced like shading and lighting and stuff it would like really accentuate or like bring out like the, the purples in like the dark blues and stuff the hues while shading and after I did like the rest of like the rendering for like all the other things I started with like the VFX like the cool like blues and the, the very very light blues and I felt it made it kind of like pop and as you can see I had a lot of layers during the drawing process, but yeah, that was my uh, Ultra Instinct Goku uh, Hope you enjoyed, uh, maybe I'll make more like this in the future, we'll see. But yeah, thank you everyone, and I hope you have a nice day.